Twitter. Yeah. Um, this is meal number two. Uh, meal number one was at around five, six forty this morning. I actually had to wake up earlier and get me a black coffee. Um, to sip on while I ate my breakfast and breakfast was a three ounce steak and two whole eggs and about 50 grams of granola um, that I weighed out so then afterwards I did a little bit more posing and went on to just relaxing until I had to come here for my next meal and of course I have to spread them out but today is uh Today is the day. Everything I've done worked for it. It's been hard um, and more than I can ever imagine. Uh, this is a life that I never thought I would live. And now this is the life that I want to live. You know, um, Ronnie Coleman once said, you have your dreams as what you want to do in life but God also has a path as to where you should be in life so you can want your dream all you want I wanted to be a football player of course you know big lights blah, blah, blah. really good at football but my life God's path has led me to this life which very demanding for instance you know this is some food I haven't had in four you know probably about a good three months and I have to sit here and wait on an exact time to eat it because I've learned to stop questioning my coach um, he know what he's doing um, Matt Brown really good guy uh, team complete nutrition team campus muscle stays ready today we're gonna kill it so uh, it's about two hours since or actually yeah sorry my first meal was at 5 40 sorry uh, but it's been about two hours and I um, want it to all settle in perfect to start filling me back up since I've been so depleted um, by the time I hit stage and by the time I hit stage I'll have a Reese's cups right before for the vascularity and all that stuff just little trace and trade so uh, yeah here's mode two and um, I'm gonna enjoy it <laughs> um, we have to be at the venue by 8 30 um, it is currently 7 43 um, and we're making we're making good timing so stressful but hey that's what it takes to be successful so salute oh I'm sorry I have to pray doesn't make me fat. Mm. It's good. <laughs> it's amazing, man. Next group up, novice men heavyweights. Seven trade places for me, six and seven. Number nine, can you take one step to your right, please? Eight, yeah, there you go. Quarter turn to your right. 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 Front double bicep.
Relax. Front lat spring. Relax, quarter turn to your right. Side chest. Relax, side tricep. Relax, quarter turn to your right. Rear lat spread. Relax, rear double bicep. Relax, quarter turn to your right. Side chest. Relax. Side tricep. Relax, quarter turn to your right. Hands behind your head, abdominal thigh. Relax, your favorite most muscular pose. And relax, gentlemen. Thank you very much, may exit the stage. to sip on water throughout this meal but that's just to help it get go down I want to look dry I want to look very dry um, and keep as much water weight off of me as possible so I personally I don't I won't drink my water or even sip on it you know I'm I'm thirsty I'm dehydrated right now almost um, but that's what, you know, the kind of things that I have to watch, you know, my water weight, which will affect how I look on stage. And like I said, it's only if I need it to help get my food down, which I can do without the water, you know. I can drink water tonight or something. I don't know when I really, when I win. So, but for now, hopefully they didn't salt this. That's the little stuff I've noticed too um, that I tend to do. And the food, you can taste every little thing on it. Um, I can kind of actually taste the grease, uh, which is crazy, but before I wouldn't be able to, you know, the grease was like, mm, yeah. You know, I love, give me four, more grease. But once you're deprived of something so long, and then you have it again, food and the texture of it is just it's different like it's something I really can't explain it so you really go through it but yeah it's it's pretty awesome though you know fattening but awesome but yeah hopefully and that's the stuff I watch for and worry about now is salt that sodium right there sodium it starts making you look bloated having that bloated look and um, that's something I don't want on stage unless it's in my muscles It'll blow me up all you want so you can see the little grease I'm not sure if that's gonna help me but like I said coach says do it let's get her done
front double bicep. Relax, front lat spread. Relax, either side, your favorite side, try chest shot. You can find your side chest, please. Relax, turn and face the curtain, please. Rear lat spread. Relax. Rear double bicep. Relax. Your favorite side tricep shot. Side tricep. Relax. Turn and face the audience, please. Hands behind your head, abdominal and thigh. Relax. Show me your favorite most muscular pose. And relax, gentlemen. Thank you very much, you may have some stage.
job, baby. Gentlemen, if you don't mind, I need for the lightweight and middleweight to exit, and I had to wait. I like, don't leave. I'd like for you to hit a shot by yourself with the ladies. Amen. Right. The lightweight exit. Thank you, gentlemen. Amen. You I'm sure you won't mind that. Then after you're done hitting the shot with them, hit your favorite pose. Relax, your favorite most muscular pose. Oh, 
up on me and I still <laughs> came, baby. <laughs> Dude, get away from the oh, sword. Got me. <laughs> you did good, bro. No, I'm so proud of you. You guys don't understand. I mean, we've been so, through with yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, trade, but you know. But first, like, yeah. to my family, just want to thank God. First. Um, Number one. We got a sword to fight, fight his battles, you know? Yeah. He did it. Why do you guys laugh? Like, I don't get you guys. He did it. He did it. He's did it. But, uh, hard is working, right man. <laughs> hard work pays off. Put God first. Speak it to an existence. Say you will. Say can't. Not the uh, picture. You do anything, man. Uh, today was a good day. Uh, good support behind me. Nothing but hard work. Um, and this is just the beginning. Everybody back there saw it in me. Uh, felt really good. Um, we're going to continue this journey to the next stage. You know, I told them I wanted to do Mr. Indiana. They was like, no, go further. So, but you got to stay faith. I mean, focus on the task at hand. And uh, you can't just say you won, you know, because the battle's not won exactly. So, and when I got off the stage, I was like, uh, so is that, that it? And it was like, yeah, you just whip it all. I was like, one like like is this over so i can go get a pizza now you know what i'm saying so um but what i really love this you know i gave these people around me a lot of attitude um but no it, you, you don't you don't honestly you don't understand until you go through it with any kind of anything like start stressing you out your body fluctuates in a way that can you know be a win to a loss. So, with me kind of hanging up on my brother today, today. Um, I had hung up on him. And, and, and it's because it. he started raising his voice, but that's <laughs> next, and so, you know, but that's for a different day. But, um, yeah, this is the beginning of the road. We got the long journey in front of us. Um, I thank my family, my family, my support. Uh, I heard them out in the, the audience and that made it a little bit better, like knowing, you know, I mean, I already had God, that's all I really needed, but I mean, it was just good to have, this is, I invited so many people, but this is Yo who, brother. you know, yeah, this is who, at the end of the day, you know, you will fight with you to the end. Right. And Landon, right. do not touch my sword. <laughs> and I'm not telling like, Landon to touch my sword or anything. But overall, again, it's God's grace. Speak it to right. existence. I had to tell so many people back there that, they, you know, they lack confidence is because they don't, they don't have the Lord. Um, and that's all I, and honestly, people kept on saying, oh, you should feel like crap and you should, it, it sucks, don't it? I'm like, no, it, you know, I feel fine, you know? And it's because I noticed that I put it on to the Lord. And that's, 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 that's changes everything. Okay. So, um, 
Now we're about to celebrate, go get some pizza. Go hammer! I haven't had a pizza in forever. I did have a burger, cheeseburger and fries, and I did not understand that this morning. And I was telling you, you know, about it. I was like, God, this, this like cheese, that. like, it makes you fat. Like, wouldn't I be fat on stage? But this man right here is like, no. You know, trust me, he brought me in where I, you know, still gave him some stuff at the end. Um, just kind of questioning because... But there's honestly a science behind this. And you can do your, if it fits your macros, you can do your um, whatever, but there's a science behind it. And no one will truly understand it. And it works different from different, pre different people. And we're, we know my flaws now, we're gonna fix them, make it even better. And uh, I'll be on the big, big stage one day. And uh, you know, I'm bringing everybody with me. That's that's the plan, you know. Campus muscle. It's it started from nothing. From it's a campus. Year. It's about a campus is a group of people, a group of people coming together and having a big goal. Um, and with all of these people around me, they're gonna be. They support campus muscle, and they're gonna be a part of campus muscle in some way. And campus muscle is gonna be a big thing um, one day. So.